everyone, welcome to Malaysian Chinese Kitchen. Today I am excited to show you how to prepare a sweet and sticky roast pork dish known as cha siu or Chinese barbecue pork. Cha siu is delicious eaten on its own or added to popular snacks and dishes like cha siu bao or wantan mee. Let's get started. To prepare cha siu, you need maltose or malt sugar. Maltose is a little bit hard to incorporate and so I will have to dilute it with a little water on the stove. If you do not have maltose, a good substitute is honey. Maltose, as you can see, is very sticky and hard to incorporate. So I'll have to dilute it with some water. In this saucepan, I have half a cup of water and about 7 ounces or 200 grams of maltose. To this, I'm going to add 2 tablespoons Shaoxing rice wine. 4 tablespoons hoisin sauce 1 teaspoon 5 spice powder and 1 teaspoon dark soy sauce When the marinade comes to a boil, you want to add in two cloves of minced garlic and then you want to boil over medium-low heat until the marinade is thick and syrupy After about 10 minutes, our marinade is thick and syrupy Turn off the stove and add 1 teaspoon sesame oil. Allow this marinade or glaze to cool completely before proceeding to the next step. This is 3 pounds of pork shoulder which I've cut into thick strips. I did trim off some of the fat but not all of it because you want some of the fat in there. I'm going to transfer the strips into this Ziploc bag. Pour about half of the marinade into the bag. We are going to leave the remainder for a glaze later. Allow this meat to marinate in the refrigerator for at least 4 hours or overnight if possible. To roast this char siu, you want to preheat the oven to 375 degrees Fahrenheit or 190 degrees Celsius. Then, you want to line a baking tray with aluminum foil. Place a metal grating on the foil and brush it with a little bit of oil. This is to prevent the meat from sticking to the grating. Place the marinated meat on the metal rack or grating. Place it in the oven for 25 to 30 minutes. After 25 minutes in the oven, it is now time to brush on the remaining marinade or glaze onto the char siu. Flip 
flip it over and also brush some marinade onto the other side. Place this back in the oven for another 10 to 15 minutes. Our char siu is ready. Looks really good and smells very fragrant. Time to slice our char siu. And there it is. Sweet, sticky, delicious char siu. Perfect with steamed rice, noodles or added into char siu pao. Do give it a try. Please remember to subscribe and I'll see you again soon here on Malaysian Chinese Kitchen.